Terrific discovery of the remains of 215 indigenous children at a former residential school in Canada prompted outpourings of grief. Joining the chorus, Pope Francis today expressed his anguish and said that he was pained to discover the remains of the 215 children who were students at a former Catholic school. Addressing pilgrims and tourists at St. Peter's Square, he urged all Canadian politicians and Catholic religious leaders to cooperate with determination in order to shed light on the finding and to seek reconciliation and healing. I follow with pain the news coming from Canada about the shocking discovery of the remains of 215 children, pupils of the Calm Loops Indian Residential School in the province of British Columbia. I join the Canadian bishops and the entire Catholic Church in Canada in expressing my closeness to the Canadian people, traumatized by the shocking news. The sad discovery further raises awareness of the pains and sufferings of the past. May the political and religious authorities of Canada continue to collaborate with determination to shed light on that sad story and humbly commit themselves to a path of reconciliation and healing. These difficult moments represent a strong appeal for all of us to move away from the colonizing model and also from the ideological colonization of today and walk side by side in dialogue, in mutual respect and in the recognition of the rights and cultural values of all daughters and sons of Canada. We entrust to the Lord the souls of all deceased children in residential schools in Canada and pray for Canadian indigenous families and communities in pain. Let us pray in silence. The revelation of the remains has prompted renewed scrutiny of the Roman Catholic Church, which operated the Camlop School from 1890 to 1969 under the garb of assimilating these children into dominant Canadian culture. These juveniles were often subjected to neglect and abuse. The Canada's Truth and Reconciliation Commission labeled this act as a cultural genocide.